Hi YouTube, how are you guys doing? This is Faith Eno. I'm trying to do um, another way of video uh, filming um, for YouTube. I'm not talking like edit it properly and make it look all nice and stuff. But hopefully I'm going to try something new. Hopefully it will be nice. Um, before anything else, go ahead and give this video a thumbs up. Make sure you go ahead and press the subscribe button. Um, if you have any friends that have done, you know, the surgery, why don't you just go ahead and mention my name and direct them to uh, my video. Maybe they can get some information that they uh, didn't know or I can get information that I didn't know from them. So this video is just going to be just a, uh, not too long of a video. I just want to talk about um, what I, no, hold on one second, let me turn down the value. <laughs> I slid all the way down. So, um, I don't know if you guys seen my video yesterday, but um, I did my appointments with my the surgeon I see uh, that did the, my surgery, um, and he uh, said that I'm doing really great. I'm on really really good track. The only thing was I was taking potassium, which was this, and he told me not to take this any longer because this can actually affect my heart. So I'm not going to take it any longer. I'm just going to put it to the side. Uh, I'm not going to throw it away just in case one day they tell me, you know, I need to take it, then I will. Um, another thing they did was that they checked my my legs from like from my from my groin all the way down to the bottom of my calf to see if there was any blood clots because I was complaining of of my calves being being feeling like they're being crampy kind of feeling. So they checked. Um, thankfully, do not have any blood clots on both legs. So I'm just kind of really glad that I didn't mention it because uh, my father, -in -law, my stepfather-in-law, he passed away. Um, it'll be three years or four years coming coming now that he passed away from blood clot in his leg after he had surgery. He had hip surgery and. Um, right before he was about to come home, he passed away. The blood clot broke and went to his heart. So I'm glad that I got checked. And my father-in-law had a major big blood clot on his leg and kind of messed his leg up. So I am really good. I'm really happy that I checked and I don't have a blood clot. I, my bill of health is fine. Um, I got fit for a new CPAP. So I have the... I have the nasal one, but they always give you an extra one because I could get one and then they give you um, a filter. So I don't need to change the tubing yet, but I do need to change the filter. And this is the CPAP I have. And if you guys can see the picture, this is the one that goes straight into the nose that kind. Um, there's a small, medium, and large. Of course, I'm going to use a small one because you know, I've got a tiny little note. So, I got that yesterday because um, I wasn't able to use my CPAP and um, they told me I still need to continue using it. So, I will tonight. Yesterday, I was, by the time I got home, I did the video. I ate. I waited a little while to drink some fluids. I was just so exhausted. And I was planning on just taking a nap and then waking up and drinking some more protein, but I end up sleeping throughout the night. So I didn't have as much protein as yesterday. I think I only had like 30 grams of protein, which is not good. But I did have, um, I take the fact, but I did have some meatballs. I'm actually going to show you what I ate yesterday. So that was like 19 grams of protein. I did get at least half of my protein in, but it's not as much as protein as I wanted to. Um... And today I'm going to show you what I am, the food I ate yesterday for the first time. It went down pretty well. Um, I couldn't do the full three ounces um, because I also added just a little bit of cheese, a string cheese. So I'll just show you. So if it, this looks kind of gross, I apologize. I'm going to show you my utensils. This is the spoon that I use, the baby spoon. And this is my fork. I use the baby fork. 
it doesn't have a knife in it because I'm, I'm pretty sure the baby knife is not going to cut anything. So I use just a regular knife. But these are the my utensils. Uh, and this is the size of cup that I use. This is a three ounce container. Yep, it's three eighths cup, which is a three ounce container. Um, as ninety mLs worth, you can fit ninety mLs worth of fluid. Uh, so in here, it kind of looks nasty. Well, it doesn't look nasty, but I. It needs to be moist and I accidentally put it in the microwave a little too long because I got the pre-cooked um, pre-cooked um, meatballs and I got the pre-cooked fish and the pre-cooked chicken and something else that's pre-cooked well all the stuff that I got was pre-cooked so I just don't want to waste too much so I just want to make something and so I can have it for my husband he's going to I'll make him his regular his regular food. Alright, so I diced up the meatball at three meatballs, which is seventeen or nineteen grams of sugar. I mean of oh, take that back. Nineteen grams of pro twelve grams. I think it's twelve grams of protein. So this is the meatballs. I just chopped them up and I put the um I put um the, this white stuff that you see, oops, the white stuff that you see is olive oil based um, Miracle Whip, light olive oil Miracle Whip, which has no sugar in it, or has like one gram of sugar or something like that. Um, so this is just like, ooh, it's like a, not even a tablespoon worth. So I'm just gonna like mix this up because it needs to be moist, and I covered it with a damp paper towel. But I think I put it in the microwave for a little too long. So it's all mixed up now. So that's what it looks like. It's all mixed up. It's three ounces. It's not even. Let's see. If I pat it down gently, it's two ounces of food. And then, oh, I'm like Miss uh, Butterfingers today. Um, I'm pretty sure I'm not going to eat all this cheese. But I, this is the cheese I had still left over from yesterday. I just like, this is the length I just like cut off from the whole uh, length of cheese. And I just put this, I didn't finish it, so I just put it back in there. But I, I went ahead and added a little bit more. I think this is just a little or a little bit bigger. I'm not going to be able to eat probably all of this. I'll probably eat this and then I'll have this for like later snack or something. Um, but yesterday, I was kind of worried like if this is going to go down okay, like if I'm going to throw up or anything, but it really went down pretty good. Um, if I add cheese to it, then I could only eat three, uh, two ounces of the meat and then I don't know how many ounces. I don't know if this is like an ounce worth but uh, the rest of the cheese. So that would equal to four ounce, three ounces of food for me. Then this I'll just uh, nibble on later on. Um, I'm able to take the whole capsule of medicine so I don't have to divide them anymore. Thank God. It just makes it so much easier to take my medication now. I took my, my all my medicine and then now I'm, I took my calcium. So... After I eat this, maybe like an hour later, I'll take my other vitamins, and then I'll be good on vitamins. I made my drink already. It's four cups worth of Crystallite. Uh, what kind was it? A uh, pomegranate Crystallite. So it's four cups worth. And then I also have about it's about to here now. From here to here, this this in here has a lot of protein in there. Uh, when I made my protein this morning, because I'm going to be making it this way from now on, it has one bottle of this, of the whey, uh, the lean shake, one, one, the liquid lean shake, which is 25 grams, and then one more scoop, two more scoop? No, when I, I, for my husband, I give him two, two scoops, but for me, one more powder, which equal to 52, 54 grams of protein, and then I did a half a cup of whey protein 
I don't know how many um, how many proteins in a half a cup. Um, we lost the measuring thing, so I just put a half a cup of whey protein, which I'm pretty sure, if not, if it did, I'm pretty sure it has the whole 60 grams. So I have more than enough protein here, and I also have the PB Fit uh, peanut butter powder, two t two full tablespoons of it. I have of a banana and four things of cherry. So that's all I have. Um, if you have any questions, just leave it in the comment below. Thank you. Love you all. Bye-bye.